again as a nature paradise. So the, the UK market in particular um, uh, loves birding, um, loves nature and the landscapes that we have, um, the wildlife spotting that, that you can have. Um, so for example, the anteater um, that you can see right beside me or, or the harpy eagle, um, largest bird of prey in the Americas. So a lot of um, you know, UK citizens and, and EU um, citizens travel to destination Guyana to tick that list off because we are such, you know, um, biodiverse, strong. So we continue to do that. But the the, the leisure market, as, as we as we call them, of course, can continue to grow. And so with the establishment of the uh, the routes through British Airways via Saint Lucia, um, we're confident that we're going to attract even more leisure travellers. Uh, but that is just one segment, Neil. Right? We also have a, a major diaspora. In country and we've met with several travel agents that that that, that focus on VFR and um, we're going to provide them content to upsell because we want to ensure that you know the traffic is continuous on on those flights um, so strong diaspora and as you know they migrated in the 50s and early 60s and they're going to return second generation going to return and and explore all of those new tourism products that that we've launched that, that you so enjoy and thirdly of course we have a a constant flow of the business travelers because of the oil and gas of course uh, so you have thousands of persons um, transiting every month um, so the numbers are justified and uh, we want to ensure that we increase our, our foothold in our core market the UK is a core market for us and, and, and hence why we're here our focus cannot only be the international markets yes we're here present for, for this week um, but we've we also heavily focus on the region so we're surrounded by Barbados and uh, St. Lucia and, and, and Cuba and others, all these countries we're strategically positioned here because we want to ensure that you know our folks in, within the Caribbean and their markets travel to Ghana. Just yesterday, the minister, um, the Honorable Nezhu Walron and myself, we met with the, the her counterpart in Saint Lucia, and we've had such a, an engaging and stimulating conversation that they're already on board to do the multi-destination packaging so that we can have a little bit of experience, um, visitors that is, to have experiences in St. Lucia, then come across to Ghana and also have an experience. Barbados, um, likewise, we're, we're already twinning the two destinations, as you know, and um, you know products and, and curated packages are already being put together. For the local market as well, Neil, um, you know, the locals um, <clears throat> often say, well, you know, we can't really get to travel around the destination. The new crop of, of, of operators that we have in country are packaging various areas. So for example, in Barbies, we have a few operators that are packaging Kanji, Fort Nassau, and in New Amsterdam, we have another operator that is packaging the Esquibo um, and Esquibo Coast, areas that might not have been packaged you know, previously. So they're exploring more areas, and, and we're really happy for that because that will stimulate more domestic travel, which is one of the core objectives and aim um, of this government.